Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to Empty Paradise's Cars and Collectibles. So today's video, we got a Hot Wheels case unboxing. And as you can see, we got case J. And this case has that old school Toyota Supra as the Supra treasure hunt. So I really hope I can get that car. But also there's gonna be a lot more other new cars coming out in this case. So I'm super excited to like dig into this, cut the seals, pull it all open and check them all out. But let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna go ahead and cut the seals here and we go ahead and slice it down the middle all right so let me go ahead and just carefully lay this on its side has to not disturb anything and then this thing open. all right so first off I'm gonna start right up on the top Alrighty, so we got some repeats, but we got the 62 Corvette Gasser. We have the Hot Wheels Ford Transit Connect and the 70 Dodge Charger from the Fast and Furious, and it's also the tuned version. Alright, so we got Hot Wheel Ford Truck, Fast Feline, and another 70 Charger from Fast and the Furious. Ooh, okay, we got a couple duplicates there, but we got the uh, Batman, the animated series Batmobile, and we got two Honda Super Cub Customs. Oh, we actually got the regular treasure hunt. All right, so we got that 95 Jeep Cherokee right there, and this right here is the regular treasure hunt for the J case, and you can see right there, I don't know if you can see a little white circle in that back, section of the jeep but then you can see all the like text right there and the treasure hunt logo behind the, the jeep but heck yeah we already just got started in this box already got the regular treasure hunt the package is bulging a little bit i don't know if you can really see that right there it keeps like popping out but at least it's not a cracked blister it's just like a little bulge so that's not too bad and this thing actually looks really cool it has like the brown base and the brown wheels and everything. There's a better look at the treasure hunt logo there. But I'm going to go ahead and set that aside. And we'll just go ahead and continue with the rest of the case. And hopefully we get that super. But we got the uh, Mitsubishi Piero Evolution. And then a new color on the Nissan Maxima Drift Car. Alright, so... <laughs> We got the Rock and Railer, we got Batman Animated Series Batmobile, and the Batman Forever Batmobile. All right, we got a Diora 3, another Mitsubishi Evolution, uh, however you say that, and then a Corvette Grand Sport Roadster from Fast and the Furious as well. We did see that in the previous case, and as well as a couple of other cars, but. Let's keep going. We got a custom 2011 Camaro. We got a Lamborghini Sion and a twin duction. I right, got a Lucid Air, a Solero GT, and a BMW i8 Roadster. All right, Batman Forever Batmobile, 71 Plymouth GTX, and the Mercedes-Benz Unimog 1300L. All right, so we got Cloak and Dagger, Jaguar I-Pace E-Trophy, and Count Muscula. Alright, so I got another Batman animated series Batmobile, Glory Chaser with that golf livery, and then Dodge Van. Ooh, that's kind of a cool new design on the, uh, the Honda Civic Custom. First time we've seen kind of like a crazy design like that, which looks really awesome. So I'm actually kind of, actually kind of liking that. <laughs> 
And then a uh, Group C Fantasy. And then Teed Off 2, which that's actually duels as a golf tee. And that's the first half of this case. Let's go ahead and pull out that little center divider and continue on to the case, starting right up on top. Ooh, okay. So we got 2017 Audi RS6 Avant. We got tuned twin mill. And then we have this beautiful Porsche 993, nine, Porsche 911 GT3. Well, I actually did see that in a 20 pack recently. And that looks absolutely amazing. I do love those stripes there on the hood and roof. That is a beautiful casting. And maybe we might have, to, if we get duplicates, we might have to open up one of them and race them. I have the Hot Wheels six lane raceway and I might do a Porsche race of six different Porsches. And that one's looking pretty good for the track. So we will see about opening maybe that up or if I get duplicate. All right, so we did not get the Super Treasure Hunt. Um, I will say that. So we got the Pontiac, uh, 84 Pontiac Firebird, the Glory Chaser, and right here, this is the car that would have been the Super. It's the 1982 Toyota Supra. That still looks absolutely amazing. And in a Super form, like, it looks beautiful. I've seen pictures of it. Uh, unfortunately, we did not get it in this video, but... It still looks pretty awesome, and I do have some Amazon black boxes coming as well, so you never know. We might be able to uh, pick up that Super in one of those upcoming cases, and might be picking up another J case. So stay tuned, hit that like and subscribe button, and maybe we'll get the Super here in the near future. But let's continue on. We got the 71 Plymouth GTX, the 84 Audi Sport Quattro, and the Pagani Zonda R. All right, so we got another Lucid Air, custom 2011 Camaro, and the Sweet Driver. All right, Group C Fantasy, Bone Shaker, and a 70 Dodge Power Wagon. So we got a cool combi, Dodge Van, and Matt and Debbie Hayes 1988 Pro Street Thunderbird. It's a huge name there. <laughs> and we got a 84 Mustang SVO, Batman Forever Batmobile, and Lightning Bug. It's actually new, I've never seen that one before. Got some kind of little hang up here. All right, well, that <laughs> that's a, a bit, that's the, what you can expect sometimes from these cases. But luckily it is the uh, Solero GT, which is pretty much a generic car that looks like a supercar. Um, one of the best things about stuff like this is I do have that six lane raceway. So when it comes to cars that are like, the cars are just bent and creased and just totally messed up. I can just literally go ahead and open these up and I'll be able to race that against some like actual like supercars and whatnot in the near future. Uh, that car does look pretty cool. So let me go ahead and set that aside and you can see this in an upcoming race on my six lane raceway. But we also got the Hot Wheels High and a Pagani Zonda R. The bottom of that package is a little messed up too. I might do the same, but we will see. Where's the other car? There we go. So we got a Lamborghini Sion and the Cloud Cutter and Brick and Delivery. All right, so we got the Roller Toaster, BMW i8 Roadster, and another Pro Street Thunderbird. Okay, so we got a, another Corvette Grand Sport Roadster 
And the tuned 1983 Chevy Silverado, which actually looks really good. It's got some really nice kind of like old school designs on it. And then we got the 1987 Ford Sierra Cosworth. And the last three cars from the case, we got a Jaguar I-Pace E Trophy, Mad Splash, and an 84 Audi Sport Quattro. So wow, what an awesome case that was. Uh, we did not get the Super, but we still got the regular treasure hunt, that 95 Jeep Cherokee. And I believe my dad actually had, I don't know if it was a 95, but it was definitely like this generation and it was white. So it's actually kind of cool. It's bringing back some memories from long ago, but uh, this is still like an awesome car. This was a great case unboxing. And if you guys like this video, definitely go down and hit that like button down below. Also, you can see all these Amazon black boxes. I keep buying a bunch of these doing case unboxing videos. So if you enjoyed this video, hit that subscribe button because I do a lot of like full case unboxings as well as the Amazon black boxes. And I do a bunch of other videos of exclusive Hot Wheel content, even opening some up as you saw and racing them on my six lane raceway. But lots more videos to come. Like, subscribe, and as always, thank you for watching.